Good morning, my beautiful sunshines. Guys, we have germination in the beet plants. Like, come to my boobies. Look at that beautiful red stem. And then the cellen, the celery, celery <laughs> is coming through as well. Yeah. Oh, this is day five, I think. Yes, day five. Still nothing in the pumpkin. Like, I don't understand. Pumpkin usually most by now, but I guess it's probably seeds not vi vi viable. <laughs> I'll check on it in another few days. And then now we have the cucumbers. Yes. Let me focus it a little for you guys. So we have cucumbers and then of course more of the turnip seeds are, have started to pop and germinate. Then the carrot is coming through. Look at that beautiful thing. So pretty. Then I have the skeleton here. The skeleton is growing some roots. You see that? Let me focus that thing. Yes. Pretty. Beautiful. All right. So, progress in my garden in day five. So, it's 10 a.m. Well, 10 p.m. in the night. And I'm outside. I'm going to bring my children in for the night <laughs> because it's bedtime. update on my plants yeah um so it is it has been eight days i believe yes from the fifth to the this is the 12th of may five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve yeah day eight and look at my babies my pepper well the west indian red I label them <laughs> the West Indian red is finally popping up this one according to the package it takes um, 12 to 50 10 to 15 days so no action yet no action in the scotch bonnet and I've went ahead and planted two new thing I have this is the tomato and sweet pepper yes i'm using egg plants in my egg plants egg egg uh, what you call them egg trees yeah inspiration from instagram i tell you guys all of my thing everything that i'm doing is all inspiration from instagram and um youtube <laughs> thank god for social media y'all yeah, remember the character had in soil initial initial not <laughs> Yeah, I remember the carrot that I had in the soil the first day and the first day, right? I took it out because nothing was happening. I placed it in water. This needs to be changed. I mean, I just put in this in water yesterday. I don't know what going on for that. But 
anywho and of course I went ahead to put up some more escalions see they're sprouting new new growth because these were not on them yeah when them start rooting and thing make a plant in the soil and then of course the store of the shoe the carrot is doing magnificent I took it out of the water and put some soil in it I set another carrot not now go on it and of course we have a one little celery plant coming up all right so I separated the turnip this is a little test plot that I have right here so I, I put some in I transplanted them just a little test it, yeah I'm gonna watch it for the next couple days and then we have the beautiful pumpkin cucumber this is mr. beet cabbage that's my eggplant and then this is the remainder of the turnip plants that I repotted then the day one sweet pepper and tomato not gonna go on no, not, not a thing at all, not going here, so. Anyway, so, it is now the, um, I don't know, I don't remember, but <laughs> today is the 23rd of May, and this is an update of my plants. I planted some more, if you guys can see, the smaller ones around the back there, or the newer ones that I planted, because the other day I lost a whole lot of them. <laughs> can see these are ones that were planted before so these are the older ones old older seedlings and then some of the new seedlings right here no this one this is a new pumpkin seedling <coughs> excuse me and then these are the tomatoes that I planted recently look at that beautiful and then these are the sweet peppers as well as well my turnip they're looking magnificent yeah look at this baby here i separated them from the pot that i had them in before so i kind of separate them up so they can get a little more space and room so yeah oh if you guys followed me on follow me on ig you would have known or heard when i said that my carrot died yes it died like it died like a week ago immediately when I changed the carrot from the water to the soil it just dried up the leaf them start dry up one one until I'm just dead so I guess probably I transfer them transfer it to the soil too quick or too early I'm not sure but I'm going to start over hopefully I can get some carrots soon and I have my scallions. Look at these. Look at this magnificentness. I added two more stocks this morning. So I'm gonna watch those. But they're coming. Y'all remember these that were infested by the fungus? <laughs> Why am I still hopeful that something will come, come from them? It's like they died every seed all the seeds died and everything i don't know why i still have them i'm just so hopeful optimistic that something's gonna come <laughs> i'm just gonna dump this and then we have miss melon here yeah she's flourishing <laughs> um diy irrigation system yeah yeah and that's another one yep I'm finding use for my plastic bottles I have a surprise for you guys da -da 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 -da! <laughs> I have fruit look at my baby this is my pride and joy look at it yes look oh my can I tell you that this grew so fast I mean or maybe because I'm not around it every day, but it's like each time I come, every day it's grow like a 
inch more or two inches <laughs> here's another view of it and then we have a light skin one right here <laughs> it has no stripe or anything okay so this is the youngest of the three and there's another little one somewhere in there yeah so that's it i tell you guys your girl is resourceful look at this this is my little makeshift shed which kind of shield them from the sun i use my empty pringles tin and one of the seedling trees i had left okay so i went ahead and i added the melons to this patch yeah the first time i just grew with melon from seed from seed directly into the ground no i'm going to try them by transplanting them oh my gosh the turnips are growing so much faster in the trees see and knowing that all they needed was just some space you know how they grow so fast when they did the um the other the other thing i had in it and also the cabbage they're looking so much better i'm learning and i'm improving each day all right guys i planted out some of the uh, pumpkin seedlings there's like four of them yeah so four are planted and <music>